Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Sean Brown! You ready? You ready? Good. Well, there could be two better backdrops for a mixed martial arts live event than this Madison Square Garden, the world's most famous arena. And you remember when we finally got here in 2016, we've been showing up strong ever since. Every time you go to MSG, you should come with a big event. This is a phenomenal arena. This is a fantastic fight environment. New York City, baby. The city of dreams. And now some separation. Faber gets the early takedown. That did not take long. Here. Looks like a pretty good attempt here. Oh, submission defense on full display there. He said that he was very aware of what the guy brought to the octagon and it showed in that defense. Oh, submission defense holds up again. It's on point. He's constantly under attack and he's constantly backs away the submission defense back to back. Brady goes for the takedown and misses. Well done. That's the pick. We'll see what he can do. Big power shot there. He's got to start moving his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. Huge block there. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. Yeah. Might as well use it. Oh, that is a nasty inside leg kick, DC. It is a great technique, but it only takes one time to check it. Right. And your night can be over. Or it up like Anderson Silva. Be careful. Got an issue. Here's a test. Anderson land right there. His opponent wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Looking to land the leg kick now. All right, so perhaps he's going to have to address it. They're going at it here. Huge shots landing on both sides. And back to his feet. So 100 minutes to go here in what has been a competitive and action-packed first round. Faber gets caught with that punch. So pretty good recovery by the opponent after getting stuck. This is a crazy high pace. Cable in. Heading back to the corner now, and however deliberately, Brady's corner has some work to do. They're going to take a look at that lip. Hopefully the cut man can do his thing and just make sure that it doesn't continue to bleed and provide further adversity for him in this fight. All right, let us show you the highlights now from that previous round, of which there were a lot, including the strike that we believe was the one that opened up his lip. He opened up a cut on the lip. It's bleeding pretty good. It's not in a horrible spot, though. It will hurt whenever he gets punched on the lip again, but it's not under the eye, it's not on the brow. He can get through this. He's just got to be a little more careful. And he told us in the fighter meeting he likes the taste of his own blood, so that helps things a little bit. He's going to get a lot of things, he's going to get a lot of it now. All right, next round is underway. We will continue to monitor that storyline moving forward. Beautiful combination there by Faber. This crowd is going sick after what they saw in that previous round. Truly an all-out brawl. Some of oh! Just out of range. Oh, what an offering up over the top. This fight's going to be over. Now, what a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, big elbow. Nice takedown defense. Favors 
bleeding from the mouth now. A cut there on his lip. That doesn't look like fun. Great head movement. He's in a lot of trouble. Back to his feet. Oh, look at that. And now it's it. Oh, and now an uppercut. So we have passed the midway point in the fight. Shots raining down. Brady's in half court. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Nice. He's got that arm triangle. Watch him pass to the opposite side. It looks real tight. He'll drop his weight to try to finish his technique. He's off. What's the mission defense on this play? Faber gets back up here. Really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Well, the octagon, not a great place to be when you're looking for a rest or a stool. His stamina has been a huge issue tonight. It's abandoned him, but he did it. He tried. He fought as hard as he could for as long as he could. Now it's about survival mode. He was able to get his hands up to block that one. 20 seconds to go round two. Oh, oh. oh that's it! Oh, my God! I mean, you gotta be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on SportsCenter tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something, and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. 